Hey, what is up everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now for all you guys who didn't know, Connor Hollebuck is not interested in re-signing with the Winnipeg Jets. Now I'm sure you guys all saw earlier on in the year, he basically went on and said, you know, I'm not interested in no rebuild, I'm here to win, and you know, I want to win a Stanley Cup before I retire. And the way things have been going with this Winnipeg Jets team, it does not look like they're going to win anytime soon. Now this of course begs the question, which team could afford to hire a top 5 goalie in the league like Hullabuck, and which team is good enough to give this guy a chance to win the Stanley Cup? Now one of the teams topping the list of course being the Edmonton Oilers. I mean it's no secret at all that this team's definitely struggled with goaltending in the previous year, bouncing back and forth between Skinner and of course Jack Campbell. Now honestly, I think this is a pretty interesting offer for a guy like Connor Hullabuck. I mean, offensively, we all know the amount of talent this team has, and they really do have an opportunity to win the cup every year with guys like McDavid, Dreisaitl, and honestly, the list goes on. Now also on the list, which has actually for some reason surprised me, is believe it or not, the New Jersey Devils. Now again, like the Edmonton Oilers, this team is full of skill. And playing with young guys like Jack Hughes, who are honestly super eager and hungry to win the Stanley Cup, this is a team that I could definitely see Hullabuck signing for the long term. Now also the other day on the radio, of course I had to bring this up guys, don't roast me too much, the Toronto Maple Leafs. Now my first question in my mind was, how could they even afford a guy like Hullabuck when they're paying their core four players over $40 million? Now of course the Leafs have so much skill on their roster. But you know, there's just so much uncertainty with this team. Like, you know, they don't know if Nylander is going to come back, where Matthews is going to go. And for this reason, alongside the issues regarding the salary cap, I find it hard to believe that Hallibuck will go to this team. Now, a few honorable mentions I've seen online as well include the Pittsburgh Penguins, the Ottawa Senators, and finally the LA Kings. But anyways, let me know down below what you guys think. Do you think Connor Hullabuck is a top 5 goalie and really has a chance to win the cup? What team do you guys think he's going to go to if he doesn't sign? I mean, after all, he has until July 1st to sign with the Jets. But anyways, as always, I hope you guys all enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.